Atlanta, accusations that Fulton County District Attorney Fonnie Willis had an improper relationship with a special prosecutor she hired seek conviction of Donald Trump and others for interfering in the 2020 election in Georgia have led to renewed calls for Willis be removed from case. Willis defended her hiring of Nathan Wade, who had little prosecutorial experience, and did not directly rule out a romantic relationship. The allegations were first made public in a motion filed earlier this month by defense attorney Ashley Merchant, who represents former Trump campaign staffer and White House aide Michael Roman. Merchant alleges that Willis' office paid large sums of money to Wade and that Willis then improperly benefited when Wade paid for the two to go on vacation. But Wade's wife's divorce filing last week includes credit card records showing that Wade purchased plane tickets for Willis to travel with him to Miami and San Francisco. Willis, an elected Democrat, has shown no signs of resigning. But there are ways he could be removed from office. What can a judge do? Merchant's motion asks Fulton County Superior Court Judge Scott McAfee to bar Willis and Wade and their offices from further prosecution in the case. In fact, another judge, Fulton County Superior Court Judge Robert McBurney, took this step in July 2022 while presiding over a special grand jury investigation that preceded the indictment in the election case. Then you. He argued that Willis had a conflict of interest because he hosted a fundraiser for his Democratic rival in the lieutenant governor race. McBurney ruled in Jones' favor, writing that the situation went beyond bad perspective and created a clear, real and indefensible conflict. He barred Willis and his office from prosecuting Jones in the case. If McAfee decides take similar action and remove Willis and his office from election case, it would be responsibility of Georgia Prosecuting Attorneys Council to find another prosecutor. Handle case. This person may continue down the path Willis followed, choose to pursue only some charges, or dismiss the case altogether. Former Gwinnett County District Attorney Danny Porter said it may be difficult to find a prosecutor willing and able to take on the expanding case. He said only a few district attorneys in the state have the resources to handle such a case. Can Willis stay off the case to save him? Porter said his entire office would likely have to withdraw from the case if Willis recused himself. In this scenario, it will be the responsibility of the prosecuting lawyers' counsel to find someone to take on this job. Attorney Norm Eisen who served as former President Barack Obama's ethics czar, said at a news conference Saturday that based on what he knows so far, disqualifying Willis or Wade has absolutely no legal basis under Georgia law. But Eisen said, the wise thing to do at this point is for Mr. Wade to voluntarily end his time on this case. Although he is not Lega.